Hey everybody, it's Lighthouse Friday. But before we get into today's episode, I want to announce February 4th, we're doing a live concert here at the Lighthouse. Click on the link in the bio to sign up to make sure you can be there. Now, it's late January and there's not that much going on in the garden this, this week. So what I thought I'd do is do a little rewind to 2022 to when I, the, when I built this little brick path that you see behind me there. So once upon a time, there was a great big rainbow in our backyard, and then a great blue heron walked around our creek, but there was no brick path. So I called some buddies, Pete and Jennifer Peterson, Matthew Guest, my bro brother-in-law, Marty Booth, and they helped me get this big pile of bricks um, off of a trailer into our front yard. Then I rented a sod cutter and cut this swath out of the grass. Then I got a bunch of gravel, a pile that just a couple inches deep then I got some sand and covered it all up he worked into the night last night until after dark and get it placed so you can see the handy wick what you say there pathmaker hey well um, making a path makes me think of Isaiah 26 7. Honesty is the path good people follow, they follow the path that is straight and true. But well, this is a path of lies because it's crooked. Yeah, unfortunately, <laughs> lies and deceit it is. Yeah. It's a crooked, crooked path to the lighthouse. So despite that passage from Isaiah, I really wanted to make a curved path because a curved path in the garden kind of makes you slow down and take in your surroundings. The path from the bridge up to the lighthouse was laid by my son Jonah. And then we planted some forget-me-nots up to the lighthouse steps. And that's it for another episode of Lighthouse Friday. Thanks for tuning in and don't forget to click the link in the bio to sign up for our Lighthouse uh, Live at the Lighthouse concert coming up this February 4th. All right, see you next week.